How to find a need in a market and fill it. One of the best ways to come up with a successful business model, whether it's for a product or a service, is to find a simple need in a market and then fill it. In other words, what do people want that they don't have, and how can you satiate that need for them? If you can do this, then you'll be able to clearly communicate the value you offer and theoretically see a lot of sales as a result. In this presentation, we'll look at some ways you can identify those needs and fulfill them. 1. Look at existing products. One way to find a gap in the market is to look at the existing products in that space. What you'll likely find is that a few companies have got the niche stitched up, but that there is still room for improvement and still room for new products. Ask yourself, who are these products not catering to? What don't these products do that could be useful? 2. Look for pain points. They say that a good writer should always write what they know. Likewise, a good business strategy is to always stick with industries and niches that you understand. In other words, when you choose what you want to make or offer, it is best to choose something that you understand, rather than something that you've never used or experienced yourself. This way, you can think back to your own personal experience of that thing and ask yourself what could have been done better. Or if there is a product or service you use every day and it fails, ask yourself how that product could have been made any better. Is that something you can fix? 3. Survey the market. Another simple way to find things that aren't out there is to survey the intended market. In other words, ask the people you're selling to what they would like to see more of and where they feel their needs aren't being met. 4. Consider smaller cross-sections. Speaking of the market, have a think about who the market includes and whether there is a group within that market which has distinct needs not felt by the rest. Maybe people who work night shifts could benefit from a twist on an existing product, or people with a certain disability. All these strategies can be fantastic ways to find new business opportunities. But remember that what made Steve Jobs so innovative and successful was his ability to anticipate what the market needed before the market knew itself. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.